Hello everyone and welcome back to another episode of Let's Play Environmental Station Alpha. In the last episode we got a key and started up an orb quest here. Not much else actually, and we got a few diskettes. Oh, and by the way, I did die on the way back here, so I had to do all that over again. Yay! Anyways, let's just go. I said let's go! Because our next destination's up in here, the last two orbs we need to get. Alright, this is pretty easy to do. Just swing across the ceiling to get in here. Yeah, I overshot the hell out of it, but thankfully I have the V-Booster, so... All is lost. Because I got hit. Now, we're actually, we could actually do a bit of cheesing here, but there's an eyeball thingy up there, if I'm correct, so... We have to go through the crap that's above us. Hello there, buddy. You're a very easy boss. Even without the booster, he's actually pretty easy, as you can see. Oh no, he splooged on us. Too bad he's dead. Dick. He's such a butt muncher. I thought there was a secret to the left. I'm hallucinating. Alright, now if you weren't doing what I was doing, you could cheese it by just getting on this brick right here and then shooting that. But like I said, we have to, so... Yay. Oh, and also... Yeah. Easter egg room. Welcome to the graveyard of buzzsaws. Imagine we're here a joke... Imagine where a joke... No, imagine here a joke where the word peace is replaced with peace. Yeah, there's a stupid room. I don't like it. It really hurts, but it actually counts towards percentage, which is really funny. All right, let's just go. Ow, it hurts. As the music should start back up, where is it? Ow. Huh, weird the music isn't starting back up. Son of a bitch, I hate this place. Oh, God. See if we can get up to that red brick. Yeah, that's not tasty. Stop it. From right, there should be an eyeball thing in this room. So let's turn off our crap. Come on, be here, be here. Yep, there it is. So yay, we got it now. We never have to come back into this room. Ever. Yeah, weird, the music isn't starting up. Hey, there's this. This is actually an exit to another place. I just forgot where. Let's just move along. Music's back up. I guess I had to touch a certain part of the floor. No, let's just go the wrong way and not get out of here. Okay, let's go the right way this time and get out of here. Ooh. We nearly bit the fucking dust. I don't think that's all the orbs. I feel like I've missed one. I guess we'll find out right here. Yeah, we've missed one, but I guess I can show this off now. We still haven't found out how to open this particular chamber. Blowing the door up would be would be way too dangerous, but there's not enough time for nonsensical riddles here. Some analysis indicates that there's some kind of energy source keeping the door shut. Destroying that source, or sources, might solve this mystery. My cat's in here with me. He's sitting next to my butt. Cause he likes butts. Alright, let me check my map really quick, cause... Yeah, I think I know it. I think I'm starting to see where we may have missed the last one. I said think. It's those little pink dots, by the way. Weird. I don't think there was one in here. I guess it doesn't hurt to check, just in case. 
Yeah, there wasn't one in here. It just led to that riddle room. But I'll check just in case. I remember getting maybe three orbs. There's one. Yeah, weird. Don't blame me, it's been a while. My memory isn't perfect, you know. But it shouldn't take too long. Just a couple of checks and we should find it. Wait a sec, I remember now. How could I be so stupid? Ta-da! There it is. Goodbye, good sir. It was past the teleporter room. I right, watch out for that. That'll do like three damage. It's sort of dangerous. All right, let's go save because this is our only save point here. That kind of the one that we do use to get to the thingy, the orb puzzle with the eyeball to the right of it. Wrong way. I'm derping hard. Oh, uh, this is a really easy maze right here, but we can just pretty much entirely skip it. And with that... The door opens. And we can move further into the temple. The ruins. The Chozo ruins. Alright, time for a Mega Man-esque style. Ouch. Pain in my ass. I don't think we can actually hurt that hand. No, we cannot. Yay. Oh, this place is very unfriendly. It really sucks. Good thing the boss isn't really that hard. Oh, you cannot destroy those. So let's just move along. Before it shoots me. Well, hello there. Uh-oh. It's mad at us. Good thing we can cheese this boss. Yeah, I should have jumped and did that. Yeah, he's really not hard, but he'll kind of give you an idea of how tough bosses can be. Too bad he's dead. Damn, I love this gun. Just as they said, there are some suits left here. The AI mainframe room cannot be entered now that the security system is kicked in. So my best bet for deactivating it lies in the AI control room. If anything, I can look up some data on what kind of virus it could cause that could cause this much chaos. And there we go, we can now go to the control room. After we get this. We found the heat resistant suit. You no longer take damage from the heat. Yay, which means we can fully explore the heated area without issue. Thankfully they give you a save point shortly after so you don't fucking die. So be thankful for that. You best be thankful. And here's, let's go this way. Oh yeah, I remember an easy way for doing this puzzle. Let's wait a minute. Normally you have to go through this stupid convoluted quick maze, but if you just go, touch the button, swim through the lava, you'll get through here with no issues at all. It's my best recommendation. For all our efforts, we get a data diskette. Something we desperately need. Yay, that really hurt. Thank you. Thank you, thank you. You're too kind. Alrighty, let's move along. Watch out for those fire bars. Totally not ripped straight from Mario. Alright, we just got a quick, easy room to go through right here. Alrighty, drop down and shoot to the right. Wow! We barely avoided that now, didn't we? There we go. And see you later, buddy. And look at that! We're back here. I think the save point was right here. No, it was not. It was down. Let's just go to the one down below us. I trust it more. Now we can actually get the upgrade here. I'm going to give it a few shots, actually, because this is really worth it to do. Save, and let's move along. So we're practically done here. I said practically. So now we can actually explore deeper, which we're going to do. But I don't want to do that just yet. 
I want to try to get something. And I've done this before, and it's really fucking hard. So let's get going. Let's get going. Buddy, get off my butt. I know you like butts, but that's no reason to sit against my butt. Alrighty, let's move left. I highly, 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 highly... I can't stref stress enough how highly important it is to save before attempting this. Now I'm gonna give it a few shots. If I fail, I will I will cut to the attempt I succeed or I just give up. So here's the room where you get an optional amazing upgrade. And as you can see it's full of a lot of shit we don't we can't pass through without it, so let's give it a shot. Alrighty, we wanna dash jump. Touch the now I wanted to touch the spikes because they do less damage and swing and fuck it up yeah this is not something you're supposed to do owie son of a bitch Luigi's dead as you can see that's not a sequence break you're really supposed to do alright attempt number two of three and then I cut for time reasons. So, damn it, I want this now. Alright, let's try it again. Let's boost, get hit by the lava, and take a fuckload of damage. Just drop down, get hit by this, swing. Let's try it again. Be careful, you can glitch in the lava and you'll stay in your swim state taking constant damage. I'm dead. I ain't gonna make it now. <sighs> Told ya. It just wasn't gonna happen. Alright, attempt three of three. Come on, third time's the charm game. Or I'll have to cut. Who knows, maybe I'll leave it in as a blooper reel. I can't. We can do this. I am confident we can succeed in this endeavor. And swing. Alright, we're doing good so far. I need this health to survive something. And shoot down, and there we go. Our reward for all this shit is... The Dash Booster X. You can now dash freely. Which means... That's right, we can infinitely dash now. Oh man, that was really hard, but I proved to you I could do it, so... I'm most likely gonna die on the way out of here, so don't be surprised about that. <laughs> well, I'll try. I'll give it a shot, guys. I will try for you. See if I can escape this hell without dying. Thankfully, though, we can cheese this shit now that we have the booster. Just take this up. This is the spot I can never avoid getting hit. Holy fucking shit, we did that in three shots. You can't believe how many shots that took me the first time I tried that sequence break. Oh my god, I want to save- this has got to be a, a record. Three shots. Third time truly was the charm. Oh boy. But anyways, guys, that's all for today. Tomorrow we will explore the rest of the heat area. We I can't believe I did that, which kind of makes getting the discettes pointless because that's what you need to get that upgrade. But seeing as I did it without the discettes, I'll still get them, mind you, just so you know where they are so you don't have to do that sequence break. But anyways, what else awaits us in the volcanic sector? Find out next time on Let's Play... Environmental Station Alpha. I really have no life. I really don't if I can do something like that.